Hey guys, welcome to Mutual Wini Business. In this channel, we share all about business-related content. So if you're interested in such content, kindly click that subscribe button so you won't miss when I upload. So someone requested for a video on business ideas which a student can do. And that's the content you're going to be doing today. And there's someone else who had requested a video on how to uh, sell on Kilimall and Jumbo Shop. Yeah, guys, I'm going to be doing this that video too. But actually, in this video, we are only going to be talking about business ideas you can do as a student. So for the one who had requested for a video on Kilimall and Jumbo Shop, kindly be patient with me, but I'm going to do that content immediately after this one. So as a college student, there are so many things you can get yourself into. This is a phase where you have a lot of time. You're not so much committed because obviously you don't have the classes every day. The first business you can do is selling handmade goods, and that can be crocheting or DIY deco stuff or anything you can think of maybe i'm sure you have seen so many people maybe on tiktok or instagram who are selling crochet made bags and tops and skirts all this stuff guys so if you're good at that scale you can make money from that you can sell these goods to your classmates you can sell them online that is on facebook on instagram and also you can sell them on the, your local marketplace nearby the second business idea is very popular, especially since 2020, and this is starting a YouTube channel or maybe becoming an Instagram influencer. For you to get started with YouTube, the only thing you will need is a smartphone and maybe a ring light. But if you can't afford to own a ring light from the start, you can just make sure that you're recording your videos through the use of natural light, and that is the sun, and that means you need to record at daytime. So how do you earn with YouTube? You can earn with YouTube through ads or sponsored uh, products or sponsored vlogs. So when it comes to earning through ads, you have to get to 1,000 subscribers and also 4,000 watch hours. And after getting to that milestone, you can monetize your channel and become a, a YouTube partner. And that's how you're going to be paid through ads on youtube google ads the other way you can earn is through sponsored products or videos that is you can work with brands on your channel maybe they give you your their product and you have to review it on your videos or you advertise their products on youtube or maybe other businesses on the other hand you can earn with instagram by being an influencer all you need to do is approach companies don't go for those big companies because obviously you don't have you're not yet there you're not a celebrity so you just have maybe 10,000 followers or 15,000 followers on instagram so you can approach these companies and advertise their product then you're going to get paid when someone makes a purchase from your advertising that business idea has always been popular among students and that is freelancing and freelancing is actually wide you can do editing you can do copywriting you can do academic writing you can do blog post writing here how you have to do is learn where you're good at and Find your own clients, maybe through Fiverr or Upwork. Or if you you have access to direct clients, you can also work with them and make money. Guys, there are students who are actually paying fee through freelancing. So guys, if you're serious with this, you can really make good amount of money. It's something which I've personally tried. So if you're serious with it, you're going to make good amount of money. So the fourth one is actually booming right now. It's one of the best side hustles you can do online right now. And that is affiliate marketing. And with affiliate marketing, all you need to do is have a, your own website where you post your blogs. You can use special links through which people get to purchase those products. And once someone purchases a product through your link, then you're going to get commission from that. If you have more audience, that means that it's more money for you because more people are going to be able to purchase through your links. For example, you can start by becoming an affiliate marketer through Jumia. Jumia is a very good example of platform that works with affiliate marketers. Yeah, guys, so you can get started with that. So if you also want to know how to become an affiliate marketer, 
you can leave a comment below and I'm going to do that video for you. So the last idea and that is the fifth one is you can become a tutor. Think of anything you're good at, maybe a skill you learned back in high school or after high school, that period before joining campus. Let's say maybe it's you learned French or maybe you got into music or skating. Think of anything that you're good at. You can teach. There are these students who want to learn French. Even other people want to learn French just because of their job requirements or any other language. Let's talk of Chinese or talk of any language that you're good at. You can offer classes and earn money from that. There are parents who maybe want their kids to learn skating. You can also offer such services. If you learned music, you can teach kids how to play piano and you earn that you earn money from that. There are so many parents who want their kids to learn these musical instruments such as guitar and piano. So guys, if you want to get to know more about business ideas you can do as a student, kindly let me know in the comment section and I'm going to do the video for you guys. So thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.